hey sweets rise and shine welcome back to another video now welcome back to another video sweets so today this video is a little bit different i've ordered a couple of things something has come to our attention today we just got a package we just got a package <laughs> i need to grow up on them so i ordered a few things from new moon beginnings from off of Etsy. I actually have a couple of things coming in right now. I ordered not too long ago and it got here pretty fast. So let's just check it out and see. I have a few things that are coming in that I've been needing. I've just refocused my energy on things that really are for me. You know, I felt like before I was doing a lot of things for other people as far as what I really wanted for myself what I was buying, what I was doing in general. Like, I kind of was just going with the flow. But right now, I feel like I'm doing things that serve me, my purpose, my inner peace, my inner. And that's what it's all about. Do what's best for you. Do what's best for your inner peace and your inner. Okay? Because we got to keep that. Okay? No, listen. Got to do what's right for you now. And be happy. I'm happy. I really am. I've been feeling really, really happy in my spirit and like, it's like everything is okay. You know, I mean like it's better than okay. Like I can't really explain it to you. Let's see. I have another notification because organics is on its way. Hey, my fruit are about to be here. Um, they shipped out my fruit from fruits and roots. I got my fruit on the way. I got some exotic fruits on the way. I'm excited about those. I will be doing a review for you guys. I am burning a sandalwood incense and it smells pretty good. I don't know. I like the smell of incense sometimes because sometimes it can get on my nerve. I'd be like, uh-uh, Quita. Let me see if I can remember what I purchased. Okay, I remember. Now, if you want a video on this, I don't mind doing a video on um the gemstones and the quartz and how they work and cosmic energy and all of that good stuff this right here is a charging plate that i showed a couple of people um most of these that are on here charging right now are going to be pieces to jewelry that i will be making I wanted to make sure that they were charged and full of energy when they got to their new homes or their new parents Anyways, these things that I'm about to show you are specifically for me. I bought them for myself. New Moon Beginnings is who I got it from. It came like this. Okay, I ordered eight items. These were raw crystals and quartz. I got a few stones. So I will tell you, I guess I'll just show you whatever it is that came in here because I'm showing them some stuff that I got. Yes. What are you doing? Okay. So. Do you need to hurry up? Because I'm ready to go to bed. Look, because I'm ready to go to bed. Them people try to tie me out. Oh, okay. So they have it like this. So I guess this is the piece that you put on the back of your phone. So it says, thank you for ordering. Please visit us again. And then it gives you all the information. So right here, it tells you exactly what kind of stone it is and also what it's good for so i'll read it to you this is a shungite it is for detoxification protection healing and grounding this right here specifically is good for emf protection purification of the body general healing and well-being so they have it to where it has like a little sticky piece on the back and you can put it on your phone this right here is a clear quartz it's for activating energizing and clarity so that is so pretty that's pretty Ooh, i gotta put it on my charging plate when i get a chance i'm so excited um i'm gonna just go ahead and leave it out of the bag this is so crazy okay so here lately i've been dealing with not being able to dream right and i talked to this girl that's very 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 in tune like oh my gosh like she is one of the most divine like oh my gosh she is so strong hands she do not care what nobody thinks that is a one strong woman she knows who she is her knowledge of self is so strong like i come on here and be feeling some type of way which i'll be saying to me 
She don't care about none of that. She will shut your ass down. Do you hear me? Now, I can't wait till I get to that point, but we'll get there. I asked her a question about why is it that I can't dream? Or if I am dreaming, why can't I remember my dreams most of the time? The only time I can remember them is if it was something that was like really crazy. That like it won't allow me to not remember it. And she was just saying it's probably like a blockage or there's something, you know, that's going on or whatever. And the clear quartz actually says down here that it can assist with spiritual development and with removing any energy blockages that occur in the body. That is an energy blockage. And I need to understand how to rid myself of that so that I can dream because the dream world is the spirit world, essentially. And you can really see a lot of things for what they really are in the dream world. So if you can remember your dreams and talk about them, you should definitely write them down and look for the key signs that are in your dreams because your dreams tell you a lot about what you need to know in your waking life, okay? Just so y'all know. Now... Oh man, this is beautiful. This amethyst is so beautiful. I actually have one that I keep in my car, which is why I decided to go ahead and get a new one. That one I do not take out of my car. I just feel like it needs to be there. This one right here is a raw amethyst. Um, it is good for intuition, stress relief, positive energy, and it enhances your creativity, promotes a good sense of judgment. It brings inner strength, wealth, evokes strong sense of business it encourages peace and stability it aids in meditation to find deep and inner peace comfort at times of loss and grief it aids in sleep and dreaming i need this i need this oh shit <laughs> it is so beautiful look at that that is so beautiful isn't that beautiful like i don't even think y'all understand the beauty in this piece right now i want this to focus but it's not gonna do it anyways this is so beautiful can't wait to charge that one up so i guess this is all eight of my pieces so they came a little bit smaller than i thought they looked a little bit bigger online which okay that's perfectly fine whatever this is my wand i'm so excited it's beautiful so this right here is a raw selenite a uh, selenite helps with cleansing, protection, and healing. And I wanted to make sure that it was something that I can hold in my hand. So this is perfect for all types of energy cleansing. This right here can really help remove stagnant energy and negative energy. It's one of the most powerful minerals that works very quickly. Selenite stone is also gentle and magnifies the energy of anything that is placed upon them. So if I put anything on it, it will magnify its energy. And that includes self. Anytime that I feel powerless, I feel like that would be a good way to really ground myself and really amplify my feelings or my energy that I need from that stone at the time. It is a protective stone and it shields a person or a space from outside influences. So this right here will be good to keep in your doorway or right at the front of your home or in your room, you know, where you actually go to lay your head. So this helps you reveal the bigger picture behind most problems that you are going through. This stone right here is very, 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 very powerful. It's a very powerful crystal for energy cleansing, space clearing, and removing any stagnant or negative energy. So this right here is a very, very powerful stone. It is raw selenite, okay? So get you some of that. All right, let's keep going. I'm gonna get eight things, so this should be like four more things. The next um, stone that I got was an ametrin. This stone is for inner peace and luck, and it helps with stress relief. And I feel like during this time right now, this would be a good stone to have, especially with everything that's been going on. Um, there is a lot going on, and I am very invested in my environment. And when I see things going on around me, it kind of affects me in a different way. So sometimes I need to just separate myself and ground myself in what I know. So this right here, getting my stones together, understanding what I need during that time, um, is what helps me best. And this is my way of doing things. I've been doing things like this for years, um, since I was a teenager and it works for me. It's been working for me for years and I don't see myself coming away from this type of healing for me and it only gets better. So this is how I'm going to ground myself. 
during this time. I'm actually making some, or some anklets and some waist beads that actually have this in it. And this right here pretty much helps with harmony, healing, and communication. So being able to converse and being able to say what you need to say in a plausible way, um, that's what this right here helps with. Let's read a little bit about it. It's harmonizing and it is soothing. So it helps you when you just really need to just ease everything out, mellow out, self-expression and confidence. It can aid you with issues of self-worth. You know, how you look at yourself, how you um, view yourself, your self-esteem, your self-acceptance. This stone is really, really good for aiding you in that process of self-understanding. It is also good for um, inner peace. It brings you a lot of inner peace. So understanding of self, when you're coming into the knowledge of self, this is a really, really good stone to have. So I would definitely um, suggest that you invest into this type of stone I really really love it it's a beautiful stone and it brings you a lot of good energy great healing stone when you're healing and you're going through things and you just need that grounding this is a great great healing stone so definitely look into soda light this right here is a raw black obsidian I do have a couple of other black obsidians but this one right here is raw. It is beautiful. Wow. It actually looks like a shattered piece of glass. That is beautiful. Wow. Look at that. You can actually see. This right here is a raw black obsidian. Another black obsidian would be like this one right here, which is a little bit more smoother. So... Black obsidians are helpful with protecting and grounding you and also with stress relief. So if you are stressed out and you're going through a couple of things, this is another good grounding stone to use um, to just help recenter you and get you back to where you need to be. Let's see. Let's read a little bit about this. It creates a shield against negativity. So this right here is a protective stone of any type of evil, negative energy, and things that don't mean you any good. Your root chakra, and it helps with grounding you again. Again, I say, um, so really having you centered with the earth and centered with self, this is a good stone for that. Also, it can draw out a lot of mental stress and tension that you have going on in your life. This is, this is really good of protecting your energy. So definitely try and look into getting a black obsidian if you don't have one. I will also recommend having black obsidian in your jewelry. That's also a good way to carry it with you or to just have it with you. It helps you to know who you truly are and it aids you in recognizing where one is holding negativity, making you face those issues and emotions. This enables us to take action to clear their root. It causes and aids in personal growth and spiritual growth, okay? does soak up negativity this stone needs clearing and cleansing after each use so once i use this stone which this stone would be good for meditating when you really just need to take a moment you need to ground yourself you need to hold it you need to take a second which all of this stuff absorbs energy which is why you do have to cleanse them after you've used it and you've been you know meditating over them and you've been trying to gain energy from them you definitely, definitely have to cleanse them. And you can cleanse your stones in different ways. I don't want to get into that right now. We can talk about that in another video. We're going to get right into this last one here. So this last one that I got was a raw smoky quartz. I really wanted to get um, raw. Wow, this is beautiful. A raw smoky quartz. I think this is so beautiful. Okay, now let's talk about what a smoky quartz is for. This is also for grounding and releasing of negative emotions, negative things towards certain stuff. But as you can see, I did get a lot of grounding stones, stones to help ground me during this time. I need something to help me really reconnect and dig deep to what I know um, and recenter myself. So I did get a lot of stuff to help ground me, a lot of stuff to help me with my spiritual growth and understanding and clarity and protection against evil because there's a lot of evil out here. And what people don't realize is that we are in a spiritual war right now and it's good against evil. And this stuff right here 
It's really what grounds us. It, it's what helps us to stay protected and to stay strong and to stay in the right direction. We're here for a purpose. And the purpose is to get back to self and to understand that we are higher and to ascend beyond this physical vessel. Okay? Once you understand that, then you can understand everything else. I, I really don't want to go too much into detail about that. But I'm just sharing information with you. You don't have to take my views. You don't have to argue with me i don't want to argue okay anyways so i'm going to give you a little bit more information about the smoky quartz it helps ground and hold you with earth's energy it stimulates balance and your chakras it absorbs and transmutes negative energy excellent for evaluating moods and overcoming negative energies and emotions and relieving depression so if you're going through a lot of depressive things you're really not feeling it right now this is a really good stone to have to kind of keep you in a nice, mellowed out mood, um, understanding, clarity, grounding with self and earth. And that right there alone will help you feel a lot more energized and a lot more powerful. It says the smoky quartz is very beneficial and it, and it is a healing stone for pain relief. So it carries a very strong connection to the earth. It is said to help treat problems in the lower torso, the kidneys, the abdomen, the pancreas, the reproductive organs, menstrual cramps, and fertility issues. Um, it is used to also remove toxins from the body and can be good for balancing and improving one's general health. Um, it is preferred crystal by healers for dealing with insomnia, nightmares, hyperactivity, and attention deficit disorders. Wow. So you see, the things that people feel that we go through in our regular life, these stones are here straight from the earth to help ground us, to help, to help keep us centered because we are energy beings and energy flows through everything. We need these things to help ground us. There's been so many distractions and so many things that's taken us away from who we are. And the root of the problem is that we need to heal ourselves. And the only way to do that is if we ground ourselves in what we know and what's true to us and what's true to spirit. And these things here, things of the earth, natural things that are right here for us, that is what's true to us, okay? Now, I'm not here to, um, you know, lecture you guys. I'm just saying. This is just, I'm just saying. Anyways, that's all. I have all of my cards here to tell me what everything is. I absolutely, absolutely loved my pieces. They are a lot smaller than I expected, but I do appreciate it. And I'm very, very happy with the time that they came in. The packaging was really, really nice and secure. They got here in one piece. They're absolutely beautiful. I'm very excited. I can't wait to use them. So please definitely go check out New Moon Beginnings on Etsy. They have a wide selection of things that you can order from them. Not only crystals, but other things such as candles. And it was just a wide selection. So definitely go check them out and see if there's something that may fit what you need in your life right now. And if you'd like to see another video on all of the crystals that I have or whatever my sanctuary or my altar looks like, just let me know and I will be more than happy to share that with you. I'm kind of trying to be a lot more open now with everything that's going on. I feel like we need to connect with one another a lot better and I want to be there and I do apologize if I offended anybody at any time during the time that I've had this channel. But, um, you know, some things it's just what it is and... I can't apologize for the truth. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in to another video. I will drop the information in the description box below if you're interested in this. Love you guys. And I will see you in another video really, really soon. Okay? Bye.